So if we take like this little section below the stairs right here, you've got a lot of stuff that you've done. Mm -hmm. How do you start? Like what do you, like? How do you envision something like that? You say, okay, I'm gonna put wallpaper. Like, what's the process that you go through to get it to the way that it the looks final right now? Because stage. I'm like, you're probably getting stuff from lots of different places. Mm -hmm. How do you string all these ideas together to make it? look the way that it does right now well with like this space or any space when i'm starting it i kind of look at it within layers if that makes sense so the first part would be like the bigger pieces like your furniture items so i knew that you know i wanted to have a table here i knew that it couldn't be super big because it's a hallway or an entryway and i don't want it to be overpowering and um so that's kind of where i would start is find like the main piece which in this case is that cabinet. And then since there's more space to fill, you know, a pretty chair with a pattern is always a good complement to a space, even though I can probably count how many times we've sat on that chair on my <laughs> hands, but it's there and it looks pretty. Um, and then after that, then it's like the extra layers, like the wallpaper, you know, the decor, the candles, the ladder, stuff like that. I just kind of build on it and then I play around with it until it's happy when I'm looking at it to my eyes. <laughs> How do you choose your wallpaper and stuff? Like all of your focal points, your textured walls and stuff. How uh -huh. do you go about deciding? Like, so I try to make it cohesive and um, so that they all kind of work happily together. Um, Cause wallpaper can be tricky. There's a lot of really bold patterns, which are great in certain applications. But I think that if you want to do more than one, you know, the more subtle, actually can make a bigger impact. I feel like that's a perfect balance because that's pretty bold, but it's not like too bold where you're like, right. well, what the heck is that? Yeah, and, it doesn't it's, look right. and it's not a huge amount of it. It's just a small amount of it. And then the other stuff in the room is more simple, like the shiplap and the board and batten. They're not really competing. They're letting that be the focal point, but, you know, complementing it at the same yeah. time. Are there other people that you follow that you get inspiration from or like uh, Instagram accounts or other people you're like oh I really like they did that or is this usually just like I'm gonna do it on my own like I have this vision this vision in my mind and I'm just gonna create it I don't really care what anybody else does yeah I mean I follow a lot of people because I love all kinds of design I feel like there's certain things maybe I don't have in my home but I still really appreciate it and love it in those applications so um, yeah I mean there's people with like all different ranges that I get inspiration from and love I feel like majority of the stuff that I do um, is stuff that just kind of comes in my head and that's why a lot of things we DIY and a lot of things we build because I can't find what I'm looking for a lot of times and I'll get frustrated because so I'm like well, I want it to be like this <laughs> and I can't find this so I have to figure out how to make that because I'll get like a vision and I'll get kind of stuck until I can recreate where I want it to go definitely it's more of um, I'm trying to find just what I want or I'll see something but I'll want to tweak it for sure I think that Eventually, at some point, I'd love to build a custom home because, like, those things that scare you are things that excite me. Like, I would love to be able to pick out literally every single thing. Like, I mean, we built this home, but it wasn't a custom home. And um, so that was kind of like our thing. I was like, I need to turn a builder grade home into something that looks custom as much as Which I can. Which you definitely have done mm -hmm. for sure. Yeah, it looks awesome in here. 